there, I am Katrina Roundtree from Luxury Escapes. The hotel that I'm about to show you is nothing short of iconic. It is smack dab in the middle of the busiest area on the island. You are surrounded by activities, shopping, entertainment, wonderful food, great spas. I think I better start the tour. Located in the heart of Phuket's most happening beach destination, the Millennium Resort Patong is a true urban escape. So consisting of two atrium-style wings known as the lakeside and the beachside, the combined 418 rooms of the Millennium are spacious, they are contemporary and you would have to say they're really inviting. Within the two wings there are several divine restaurants that will seriously tempt you to overindulge. A wider range of delicious Thai and Asian cuisine, scrumptious international buffets, mouth-watering seafood barbecues and endless gourmet breakfast choices. Believe me, this resort knows how to totally spoil its guests. Well, what makes this hotel unique? Uh, apparently, I think first, first place we're in the right location. We are in the middle of Patong. And we are built in a way that we have the most modern shopping mall. Well, it is an easy hotel for us to sell, but apparently, as the tourism industry grow, apparently it comes again to demand and supply. So I think you need a lot of uh, attention to details and touch point to ensure to have a stable occupancy. Now when you want to unwind, you can choose to chill out in the resort's idyllic spa, close your eyes and experience Thailand's famous and relaxing massage treatments. If by now you are ready to explore, you do not have to go too far. The Millennium Resort is attached to Phuket's most popular shopping complex. For a lot of people, the appeal of Phuket is not just its beautiful beaches and delicious food, but also its incredible shopping. And we have found a hotel that is directly connected to the major shopping mall here. Now, just like home, you can bargain in the markets outside, but in here, no. What I love, though, there are sales all year round. All the names are here. I am just so excited. Let's go shopping. Being a part of this amazing shopping centre means that there's a whole lot of fun right on your doorstep and it is absolute heaven for shopaholics like me. You can find fantastic bargains, souvenirs, fashion, an endless array of cafes and dining choices, a 3D movie theatre, a bowling alley and daily entertainment. Aussies just love this place. What do you think of the shopping here? Oh, it can get a little crazy. Yeah, there's lots out there to choose. Depends if you want quality or go market searching. Get your bargaining skills up. So, yeah, no, it's good. What's your tip on bargaining? Um, I normally half what yes. they're asking and then play the game. And smile the whole way through because they are lovely people here. Just make sure that you're polite at all times. I just had to show you the pool, isn't it gorgeous? I know that you can live on a shopping buzz alone, but just in case you need to recharge. This is pretty gorgeous. In fact, there are two pools at the resort that offer a blissful escape up and above the bustling Patong streets. If you need to feel the sand and the sea, Phuket's famous Patong Beach is just a short distance from the resort. As you can see, it is one of the most popular spots on the island. After dark, you can sample Thailand's famous street food at the night markets, or you can have a glass or three at the Full Moon Microbrewery. These somewhat infamous streets of Soy Bengla in downtown Patong are also nearby with a wild array of bars, clubs, discos and cabaret shows. There is actually a very elegant side to Patong and I have found for you the most lovely place for sunset cocktails. It's called Joe's Downstairs. That's the name, Joe's Downstairs. 
The atmosphere here, it is so peaceful. Can you hear the water lapping just there? It's just serene and lovely. Great tapas as well. And tonight, I think we're in for a perfect sunset. Between you and me, I think I had put on five kilograms before I'd even made it to Phuket, just thinking about all of the wonderful Thai food that I was going to eat. I love Thai food and the best place, the best place that you can have the traditional Thai food is Ban Rim Palm. It's beautiful, beautiful place. That literally means house on the cliff. It is famous for serving the best Thai food on the island. I don't know what any of this is, but you know I'm gonna love it. I'll just start with this one. <laughs> well, I just wanted to ask, because this is my first time here. So, all three restaurants here on the waterfront are linked. They are, yeah. There are three of them. There's Barn Rim Pal, which um, has been here for almost 25 years, and uh, that serves royal Thai cuisine. And then Joe's downstairs, which is the one in between where we're sitting at the moment, and we have Western-style tapas and food, and it's just a great, wonderful cuisine here. And then we have our Italian down on its own little beach down there, and that's um, very special Italian food. Who is Joe? Um, ah, who is Joe? <laughs> uh, the well, we late, didn't have enough time. No, the late owner, his middle name was Joe Joseph, and he always wanted a bar called Joe's. And now that you're living here, having moved over from Australia, what do you love about the place? I love everything. I mean, like anywhere, there's things that you don't like and that you think could be different, but it, it, it's a great lifestyle. The weather's great all year round, even in yeah. monsoon, the weather's great. Just um, to on. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to rug up ever. Don't have to turn the heater on. I love that. <laughs> I love that. And for you visiting, what's always on your wish list when you're visiting here? To, to come home with a nice, healthy glow yeah. from this wonderful weather that they have here. Yeah. <laughs> Which, yeah. As you say, you know, being from Melbourne is uh, a bit dicey from time to time. Yeah. And you're telling me that two days ago they were turning the heater on yeah. in Melbourne. So, yeah. But isn't it lovely you can come over here and even if you don't like the sun, there's beautiful spas. Oh, the yes. water's always lovely. You, you, you know, whether or not you're sitting in the sun or not, you will go home with that glow. You do. You do indeed. You do indeed. You can have a lovely massage in various different places. And as you say, the water is always beautiful. Mm. And you don't have to actually sit in the sun to get a glow because mm. you can get a lovely colour up sitting in the shade. So, from beach resort bliss to shopping heaven, Patong, Phuket and the Millennium pretty much have it all.